I actually want AI to replace us, and that immediately got me thinking, like, maybe AI taking jobs isn't such a bad thing. Maybe if they take all the jobs, and then we just become, like, a moneyless society, and we just live happy. Moneyless. Yeah. Oh, I don't know about I've, moneyless. I've, I've always thought that it's such a weird thing that us losing out on all of our jobs and AI and robots taking over our jobs is, for some reason, a bad thing. I never understood that. You know, mm. I don't. I don't understand economy either. I didn't go to high school, but <laughs> I think I, I don't, it doesn't make sense to me. Probably because it would be a situation where there's no solution for the poor and the rich are just fine. At the moment, yeah, yeah there is no solution for the poor. Yeah, that's true. It's really. To me, how I see it is mostly about control, isn't it? Because we get to earn something. If we don't get to do that, we don't really know where this wealth that you're looking for will come from, right? We just leave it up to whoever's making the decision up top to, you know, give us something. I mean, I guess if you're looking for, for, for wealth, mm. not everybody is. You know, those hard workers, they want to work hard, you know? Here in Australia, has universal basic income come up in like any kind of political form at all i'm sure like, been... someone mentioned it i'm sure yeah because it, it was a big thing in um i think 2020 or 2016 or 29 mm. it, it was probably 2019 in the democratic um uh, build up to the pres presidency here in america they were talking about there's this guy named andrew yang who was pushing for oh yeah universal I remember basic him. income yeah and then he well of course he's asian you know him. no no, no he went on the hdhd podcast that's right why. right yeah mm. and but then that he kind of dropped out of the race and everybody forgot about universal basic income but i think that make that's the only thing that makes sense to me for AI, ai to work i mm. think it's just you know if if, if ever, nobody has any jobs those easy kind of low level jobs then yeah 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 all right i don't think i had too much of an opinion on ai anyway yeah, I pretty much agree with what Flake said, and uh, yeah, I also feel like money is important. It, it keeps mm -hmm. like um, like the standard of cost, but like a like a general level. Mm -hmm. If that makes there's sense. There's definitely yeah. part of me that wants to be able to keep earning money and be able to like be rewarded for my particular efforts, and therefore, you know. Yeah. Be able to buy a house for myself and it be something I earn. Yeah. Don't laugh. You earned it, yeah. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> um, whenever I think, whenever anybody brings up AI, I always think of a particular person that we were talking to about AI, where yeah. they just kind of broke down about yeah the problem of AI art taking over. You're just kind of mean, aren't you? A little bit. I'm not gonna say who it was, but yeah. Oh, you're not gonna I say feel, who I feel it was. Like I feel like people no, nah, I feel like people get really passionate about it. Uh -huh. Sounds like okay. It does, <laughs> it it does, does, but it's not. It's not. Um, I feel like people get really passionate about it, but the thing is AI art and AI like like I saw that SAG with the with the um, with the strike that was going on. Um, I saw that they that, that was in their like agreement was that AI written movies and AI written um, yeah, movies would not be uh, it, 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 they have to. They have to like. It, it, they got. It got written in somehow that that would be a thing that they'd be protected from. Mm -hmm. um, is AI written? It, so what? I don't know. Wait, what do you <laughs> know? I, I kind of lost. I kind of lost. Lost. I literally have no idea what your point is. So but the point. they'll be protected the... from AI's script writing. Yeah, like like right because the whole thing was write writers the writers strike right because they. Yeah. And so, not enough pay, and AI's taking our jobs, right? Yeah, yeah. But well, they kind—I kind of—I think the, in the contracts was that they would prevent that somehow okay. from AI taking. But then, how are you not? How are you going to stop like a Banksy sort of situation where you get a fake, like a? I guess I guess we don't have that really though in movie like that. Mm -hmm. It's like some like a, a somebody who just uses a screen name that nobody knows who they are. Yeah. A Banksy of movies. Mm-hmm. That would be interesting. That would be. I feel like there's probably... I mean, what's to stop a writer just using AI and then getting credited for it? Yeah. I don't know. But when it comes to, um... Like, actors' as, um, like physical features being used in, like, AI-generated thing, and if they're still getting compensated, I feel like 
that's a good thing. Yeah, but when it comes to like the creativity stuff, like yeah, script writing and maybe art as well. Yeah, if AI does that and I don't know, they do it better than humans. I don't think, but they. I don't think they have. To, they, I mean, they haven't gotten there yet, right? Like they're, yeah. they're not. Doing that, that's the keyword. Yet. Yeah. Yet. Yet. Yeah. But but every, every this, this preventative action is everybody's trying to go against it in the future. Mm. But I don't know. When do you think? How long? How far off are we until we get an actual AI, like an actual computer that has consciousness? How long before we get that? Do you think? Oh, that's interesting. I mean, our technology evolves really fast, right? Like, like especially lately. I wouldn't be surprised if we already had one, and and yeah. then people have just kind of, and that whoever created it, or whatever, like whatever government did it, or whatever company did it, mm. is just like locked them in a basement, pretty much, with no connection to the internet, no connection to the outside world, you know, kind mm. of thing, like a localized computer AI. So you is. think it's gonna come out after the fact, and it's gonna be like a victim of being squished down because people are afraid of it. Well, that's interesting. You think it's going to be a victim? Like, Well, it might see itself as one if it has a consciousness. And then there's like robot, prote <laughs> robot protection acts in the future. Yeah. Of like, oh, you, you know, you shot your Roomba away. You I reckon 10 years. You think 10 years until we get something that... Yeah, I reckon it's going to... I was I, thinking that too, yeah, 10 years. I feel like... Like how from 2001, like kind of like a live robot that was supposed to be like our servant that turned against us yeah you think i'm hoping it's more like flubber though and it's just like <laughs> jelly yeah that's it's kind of scary like Shut it up. could weaponize itself you know like get into and people's thoughts like, i feel like like five years ago everybody thought oh, elon musk is gonna do all these cool things mm. he's kind of fallen off oh yeah elon and i feel musk like it's gonna be someone completely different someone he... not in the spec in the in the spotlight right now no yeah he's fallen off hasn't he yeah, he's he became a Tory. What's the, what's the he American became a, a, the, a right wing prick, yeah. anti trans prick. I think he always was. Yeah, but. I feel like before we get a um, an artificial intelligence, before we get something that has a brain for itself, I think that we're going to be cracking into eternal life through computers, like putting your brain into like a San Junipero kind of thing. Ooh, so oh much. God, yeah. Mm. I, I, I definitely think we'll be going for that before we go for, but I'd like to think that we'd be going for that before we went for AI. You know that because that would solve a lot of problem in in this world. Like um mm -hmm. yeah, if you're dying, like if you're dying of old age or cancer or etc. You, you just download I think, yourself. I think the biggest effect it would have would be on um, religion. Yeah, I, I was gonna say that. I, I think, think it would replace a lot of religion. I think a lot of people would drop off because a lot of people's reason to go to religion is the fear of death. You know? and then, so the afterlife is important. And a lot, of, rebirth. a lot of war would end as a result. No, no, no. Well, come on, religion is the reason for a lot of war. There's gonna be a lot of fighting in the Middle East forever. No, no, it doesn't. It's, I don't think AI is gonna fix that. <laughs> We're really Skirting dancing around. on the edge there. Skirting around that topic. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I was watching a show um, that like touched a little bit on the consciousness, like being able to load that onto like a, an artificial body and then you're just living the rest of your life like that. Like, if you break down, then you just pretty much reset by having think, a new physical body. I think that's one of my favorite um, sci-fi tropes, mm. definitely. I really loved San Junipero, that episode of Black Mirror, and I really liked this Johnny Depp movie. I can't remember the name of it. <clears throat> it's where he, um, the same kind of thing, he's like a rich eccentric billionaire or millionaire or whatever. And he's dying and he puts himself into a computer and everybody thinks it's just like, oh, his wife downloaded this this program so she can hear her husband, but she has to like prove that he's alive or something for some reason. Hmm. Right. It's, I can't remember. I'll, I'll try it. Let me try to find it. What's that, that Jordan Peele movie where they put themselves into just other people? Uh, us? Get Out? Get Out. That's it. I haven't watched that movie yet. Uh, oh man, you haven't seen Get Out. Just yeah. watch every Jordan Peele movie. Mm. To be honest. Yeah, I really like. I really liked. He's only made three, hasn't he? Is it just three? I think it's Us, Dope, and Get Out. Dope. Nope. Us, <laughs> Us, Nope, and Get Out. Yeah, you should look us up on your phone. Okay. I was thinking, um, yeah, if you had like a downloadable conscience that you can just transform to an artificial body, what's stopping us from like? Multiplying. I think 
everybody wants to be unique and original. I reckon that trumps wanting to like multiply yourself for no good reason. Um, I would or... fuck me. I, I would. I, yeah, that's well, the first know. thing. Yeah, I'd but, that's what you do. <laughs> I, 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 I'd hope to lose like 30 pounds first. But then, I yeah. personally oh, yeah. don't <laughs> want to like see myself. Like, I've looked in the mirror. And that's all I've ever seen, you know. If I saw myself standing there, I think I would lose my mind and just go explode, actually. Oh, that'd be really interesting. Because then you'd be seeing yourself from a different angle for the first time. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I think about that a lot. Because like, you've only ever seen yourself from your frame of reference in a mirror, obviously. Yeah. And like pictures, maybe video of yourself. But how, but do, you, how do you know that pictures really are showing exactly what you need to what you Pictures see? and angles and lenses and zoom. Yeah. It's all just... Guru says, <laughs> yeah, <yoga."> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> "Just do yoga, dude." I mean, not for full penetrative. I mean, what? what? Penetrative? What are you on about? <laughs> are we not talking about? No, yeah, no, yeah, no. we are. We are. We are. Oh, okay. We are. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. He's talking about fucking himself with yoga. <laughs> oh, I mean, you can. You just need to do yoga. I thought he was talking about the weight loss thing. My bad. She was on the wrong page. Yeah, I was Wrong not page. with you guys. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. No. Then again, I don't have one, so. It's like it's like the shove. It's like it's one of those things. It's like if you shove your head up your ass, how far would you have to shove your head up your ass before it comes out your mouth? No. Yeah. It gave me a tummy ache just thinking about it. 